When Martin Luther posted his 95 theses on October 31st, 1517, he started a literal revolution. In celebration of the 500th anniversary of Luther's history-changing act, the Uffizi Gallery is hosting the exhibition Portraits of the Reformation. When Pope Leo X offered a plenary indulgence in 1517 that would cancel the sins of the faithful if they made a donation toward the construction of St. Peter's Basilica in Rome, Martin Luther famously reacted by posting his 95 theses to the Castle Church in Wittenberg, which listed the points of his opposition to indulgences. This singular act started the Reformation, a split within the Catholic Church whose effects can still be felt today. Portraits of the Reformation at the Uffizi Gallery showcases works by Lucas Cranach the Elder, a painter and engraver who led the new movement's iconographic program with his portraits of its founders and other works promoting this new doctrine. Some of these Reformation icons made their way into the Medici collections in the 16th and 17th centuries, including the portraits of Martin Luther and his wife, and the electors of Saxony, Frederick the Wise, and Johann the Steadfast. The Uffizi displays all these works alongside engravings by Cranach that accompanied Luther's German translation of the Bible, and portraits of Florentines who were investigated for expressing interest in the emerging alternative ideas. Director of the Uffizi Galleries, Eike Schmidt, spoke to us about these works 500 years on. Well, this is uh, the first exhibition at the Uffizi dedicated to the uh, Reformation and, in fact, it uh, reopens a chapter which was very important for the Medici in the 16th century. In fact, the Medici were extremely open-minded. They did not only uh, collect uh, works of art from China, from the Near East, uh, from uh, Mexico, they also collected works from Northern Europe and in fact uh, here we have some portraits of Luther that were in the collections of Cosimo I de Medici. We have Luther and his wife, we have Luther and Melanchthon, the other great Lutheran uh, theologian of the 16th century. We have also books that were published um, uh, by Luther, discussions, theological discussions about uh, the church and the role of the church between Reformation and Counter-Reformation here in Florence. So this documents a very open discussion and the uh, very open-mindedness of the Medici who really uh, constructed their identity out of the diversity of their collections and of their uh, dialogue that they sparked with their collection. We're hoping to do exactly the same. Um, uh, we are, uh, of course, in Florence in a uh, Catholic uh, city with a Catholic archbishop, and uh, uh, we hope to reconstruct, to repropose uh, this important uh, chapter. Um, in fact, the Medici also had a uh, extremely highly developed sense of quality, as we all know, that included uh, some of the greatest uh, woodcuts uh, from the early 16th century that were collected here by Kranach, uh, the court painter of Lutheranism.